Well, congratulations on the movie, David Kelly. Loved it. Uh, Thank you. David, I'll start with you, mate. When you were doing you know, your stunt work back in the day you know, on Fight Club and films like that, yeah. did you ever think you'd be helming a film like this down the line and bringing Brad along with you? I never did. Um, I, I mean, at least at the beginning. And then uh, I think it was on Mr. and Mrs. Smith, I was shooting a short film and um, I was pitching Brad a little bit like, hey man, you know, um, doing this thing, you know, maybe you might want to do something. He's like, oh, you want to be a director? And he was thinking like, Good luck, Good buddy. Luck. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> um, long story short, our careers go off, you know, very separate ways, and that's just because um, I was stunt coordinating, second unit directing. He was doing big movies, and uh, you know, he watched my career grow, and then we reunited on Deadpool 2 for that cameo, and um, you know. It was hopefully in the cards at that point. Magic. It was fate. Dream come true. You guys all look like you're having an absolute blast on this uh, on this press tour. Is that reflective of what it was like in the whole process of making this movie? It was. You know, it, it was kind of a bubble within a bubble. COVID made it a bubble. Um, and then the train itself kind of made it even a smaller bubble. So they'd hop on the train and then just go gonzo and crazy and try to make each other laugh and cut up and all this whole stuff. And then it just, you know, boiled into ridiculousness and, and brilliance at the same time. You helped to sort of revolutionize modern action movies back in kind of the John Wick time. It feels like this is another step along creatively. But what kind of movies did you watch to kind of gear you up for something like this? Were there any films from like Japanese cinema over here or over in the US? Well, kind of there were some, you know, I definitely leaned into old school Jackie, you know, for this and just to get inspired. I think the physicality and the fights and the uh, the physical comedy that Jackie does, like we were trying to do homage to his his stuff and like I'm a huge fan of his and just blown away and, and I always, if I can do a shout out for him, uh, you know, he's visionary.